If you're looking to drop some serious cash on a bespoke camper van, Brooklyn in New York might not be the first place you think to look. But it's there that you'll find Brooklyn Camper Vans, a small shop that's building some pretty slick campers for anyone looking to try and live their van life dream. From their shop in South Williamsburg, co-founders Arthur Way and Oliver Gallini transform the Mercedes Sprinter into a pristine tiny house that can take the comforts of home almost anywhere. During the pandemic, Oliver and I were both travel filmmakers. Travel industry was dead, film industry was dead, so we decided what else. Uh, we were actually building furniture out on the streets for my new home. And after we were done with that, we decided to build camper vans. We've both done a lot of travel. I did about four years of straight travel, 35 different countries. And road trips are by far the best. That spontaneous serendipity, having to stop anywhere you want. Camper runs bring that and also a familiar home so I could come back to my groceries and my comfortable bed. And this is our shop. It's around 2,500 square feet. We do four vans at a time for a couple of reasons. One, of course, the space. Two, we keep the quality really high with the limited amount of custom creation that we do. So these are the 170. Uh, both of these are incredibly different. So this one right here, it's a van that we uh, bought, designed, and we wanna you know, explore what different technology we can use. But this is one of the early stages. So insulation, sub walls, electrical, ceilings. Then you're gonna have the shower put in and then we finish the walls so we're putting all the outlets and everything on the walls and then the cabinetry started going in. Yeah. Uh, after the cabinetry is in, then you go plumbing, connect all the plumbing or the shower and everything else. And then it starts the sink cabinet. Well, sorry, the stove cabinet, which is uh, really close to this side. So it's the last cabinet that goes in. So we always have access in and out. And then you do the finishing touches. So countertops, lights, and final touch on all the vans. This is a really good combination. I feel like this is a, the epitome of the design between me and Arthur, because me and him have really similar design, but as well, really different designs. Uh, this is kind of the mix of everything. Arthur is in love with like gold floral and clean lines. I love clean lines, but I love wood as well. So this was a big, beautiful combination between the two. So it's like, it's like oak that has been thin and like made it warm and then waterfall edges with countertops so things that we haven't really seen out there and we just like push the envelope make it more like like something out of like I don't know dwell magazine new technology constantly keeps coming out that makes van life a lot more different than their typical RV experience now with this power station you have 35 hours of AC off-grid you don't need to be in an RV park and with satellite internet especially the new Starlink roam you don't need to set up. You have faster internet in Yosemite than I have in New York. And the world could be your backyard. 